Hi, I'm Brian Phillips, Senior Product Marketing Manager at Polycom. I'd like to show you some of the unique design elements of the Polycom Real Presence Group family of video collaboration devices. I have here the Real Presence Group 500 model. And as you can see, it is a very compact design. We were able to pack a lot of performance into this very small device. One of the benefits of the small size is flexibility in where it can be placed. It fits easily in a small cabinet or even right behind a flat panel display that's mounted to the wall. You could even use this in applications outside of traditional conference rooms. For example, if you had a portable video unit you wanted to take between different rooms within a building or a campus, or even use outside of an office, a mobile responder unit for example, the small size makes video much easier to use in these types of applications. In addition, for your smaller meeting rooms, we have the new Eagle Eye Acoustic Camera. It has great 1080p video quality and a microphone built right in with just a single cable running back to the Group Series device. As you can see, it has this unique hinge design that opens up and mounts right on top of a flat panel screen. The resistance on the rubberized hinge helps to keep it in place. So it is very easy to install and it's a great option for smaller reading rooms or huddle rooms. Coming back to the Group 500 itself, you can see we're using HDMI for the display connections as well as for content inputs. This makes installation easier. And with just a single cable running to the display or content source, it helps reduce clutter in your conference rooms. We also have the Real Presence Group 700, which can also connect to many more displays and many more content or camera sources. So this is the product you want to use in rooms that need more flexibility and multiple camera or content sources, as well as integrated environments. On polycom.com, we have a detailed product brochure that spells out the differences between these different models. Be sure to check it out. Thanks for watching.